All right, well, I decided to take out these little uh, screw thingies. One's here, one's here, one's there. Let's see if this thing comes off. Yeah, it comes down pretty easy. And the module is right there. Let's see if I can get that out of there. That didn't want to move. That little, mark, that little clip didn't want to move when I first tried to do it. That's why I wanted to remove this piece. Drop it down where I can get a better view. All right. All right, I was able to get that little clip off. Let's get this thing out of here. I'm not sure how much cable that is. Coming pretty easy. I'm not gonna go too much further than that right there. No, there we go. All right, cool. Comes out just like that. Update in a second. All right, squeeze that one and this one together and they come right out. Get ready to install the, the lights on there. Get ready to install the new one. All right, got the new one plugged in. Now let's see if we can get this thing back up in here. I'm not gonna be able to film this really, but uh, it's gonna be hard to do with one hand. All right, well that was uh, not as easy as pie, I guess. It just goes back up in that little, uh, the far side just slides into a notch. This side just clips into the clip there. Now I just gotta put this uh, little thing back here, easy. Okay, so I guess I would have to say that took probably, I don't know, seven, eight, nine minutes at the most, only because I didn't know what the heck I was doing. Um, let me turn this light back on here. So, even with my fingernails, to remove those, remove three of those, pull the carpet back a little bit, a little bit of the glue on there, on the other side, I'll have to get that off in a second. But, uh, once I figured out how to get the old one out, which was real easy, like I said, this side just, you push back on that little clip, this side pops out. This side is just sitting in a groove over there. So when you put it back, it's sitting like this on the wall. You stick that side in the groove. That side clips back down into the hole or the snap with the little thing for the hole and you're good to go. Hope that helped. So I'm also gonna get ready to install my Zoom Sport grill guards. there to check see what the, uh, the car does while I crank it. Anyway, I'm happy. It was easy. Now I gotta go for a drive, but I'm probably gonna wait till tomorrow.